Let's go. And so here's Arasari, who we haven't met yet. Um, but on the other path, he shows up and is like, I'm from the surface and I'm flying this cool plane that you've never seen before. Fuck you. And that's mostly his deal. So he's Arasari. I see. So because there's still time before the preparation for the surface uh, relocation is finished, they can do one more job. And then Kirk says, You are a mercenary then? Something similar. We basically lend our units to our employer and then collect data from their actions. We're especially interested in combat data. Therefore, all this world's battles have great merit. But of course, it means nothing if you don't eventually return to the surface. So then... If you'd like to hire us, there's only one condition. And that is... Don't tell the Steel Dragons. If we encounter them on the battlefield, it's unavoidable. But if we participate in the same battle, I don't want them looking into us. I see. So you're saying what you're doing is illegal on the surface. That's right. Sword on, eh? Yeah, sword on. Yep. That's right. Yeah, I also have some advice. There's a man from the Neo DC who came here. I believe his name was Oleg. If you wish to work with him, it's you'd better not to tell the Steel Dragons. They'll attack each other for reasons beyond just his former allegiance to Shudodonius. I'll remember that. I accept your conditions. Wait for your assignment. Yes, sir. Let's go, Slay. Roger. Go fucking Slay with him. And then, Kirkus internally. Arasari and Oleg. They may have to replace Yang Long's group. And at the Hiryukai. Is there any people on patrol? Yes, the area is under General Kirkus's control, but because there are people like Shu and Safin lurking about, patrols are necessary. Hmm. We have seen enemies that don't show up on the radar, after all. For instance, when someone like Luzel uses a cloaking spell, there are a few signs, but you can't figure them out without being there in person. Signs? The area feels unnatural, because there's this sensation of evil thoughts. In that case, we, sh we should use units with the T-Link system. You say ART-1 is probably the best choice. Please send out Janassi too. His uh, Jaume is very manoeuvrable. Mm -hmm. oh, there's these two jokers. Let's go. Roger. But man, that Jaume is super cool. Reminds me of Cybuster. This was the first unit in Langrand's production of Elementals, and it was the first unit that Masaki piloted. Huh? Wow! And then... Yow! What's the matter? The T-Link sensor's picking something up. Just ahead. I love constipated, you say. Do you think it's an enemy? Nothing showing up on the radar. I remember this feeling. ART-1 to Dragon 2. Something might show up really soon. Captain? To be safe, let's check it out. All hands, battle stations. Full speed ahead. And this is uh, scenario 13, Kirkus's eyes, or Kirkus's vision. He said it was around here. Anything on the radar? Nothing, but the Earth seems to be moving strangely. But it's not an earthquake. Could it be... Let's attempt a work warning shot where the earth is vibrating. Prepare to fire cannon 6. Roger. Prepare to fire cannon 6. Target data confirmed. Fire! Okay. And then, boink! Here's Luzel. You figured it out! I should commend you. The Kizad! I suppose there's no more use in hiding. I shall lift the spell. Someone's a bunch of jokers. The Shudadonius army. And here's a uh, jog. Huh. <sighs> so we couldn't avoid them in the end. Lieutenant Kanzort Jog. I shall take my leave. Off he goes. Hey, wait a minute, Uzel. Ugh, he's gone. And don't use my full name. You're working with Uzel? So? As long as we win, it doesn't matter what we do. Use cloaking spells to get this far in. Is your target Kirkus's flank? I guess we were going to get found eventually. Whatever happens, you guys have to go down here. I'll settle the score between our co countries. All units, deploy! And obviously, they do. And here's Jog. Wipe him out and continue to Kirkus. Get ready! Jog sucks. And the SR point is... Complete the stage in four turns, right? 
Oh, clear the map by shooting down the battleship in four turns. Yeah, so it's clear the stage in four turns, and to finish you have to shoot down this guy. Ding! What the heck's up with this surface mecha? It's so good. So. You're an elemental, huh? I ain't gonna lose to that. Charge out. Surface dwellers. It's like, yeah, we're really fucking good, dude. I do love that one of all Tyson's moves is fly up in the sky and then just fall on you with its head. Just bonk. Let's go, service welder! Blammo. <laughs> I guess Leona forgot Janassi was there, so they didn't warn him to get out of the fucking way. With the giant sweeping beam sword thing. Personal to per ground missiles or whatever. You know what? Uh, Grongast Super Robot was Wiki. Wiki. Grongast Type 3. Yeah, don't mention it. Don't mention it. Okay, yeah, uh, anti personal trooper guided missile launcher. There you go. Look at these jokers attacking Zengar, thinking it's cool. Oh, look, now he's entered the fuck zone. He's done. Drill booster knuckle. Ah yes, ten damage. Incredible. Oh, 
気合のごとく残念とうなくゴンダイシャーフライトラスウェイグレイトウィールまだ引けんのだどうわったいきおどれカシューカシュープラズマホーンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデンデ Mind you that the AI in this game is purposely programmed to just fucking attack Zengar all the time from out of his range. Alright, got you in my sights. One does rocket drop and just drop. Yeah, exactly. You you got it. Hundred percent. And there, Shine just did. Uh, I'm gonna fucking kick your. I, I mean, you're defeated now. Because Shine's fucking good. Ammo, fuck up the ground. People live here, you. Duh, how dare you? For stalker, Go to the ground, ever do her? Fucking hold her back. Exactly why she's got the Neo Shackram shooter. I'd like to remind you that Lin's robot and the Fair Lion that's with her, both designed by the same dude. I know, in universe. Balin's dead. And also this thing. He helped though. He's really good. <laughs> He's really good at just making shit that's most excellent. He's like, oh yeah, I'll make that, and then I'll make two cute little robots. They're like little fairy ladies. Sure, excellent. Also, the cool samurai man. He's so good. I love that dude. I love Mr. Zoldok. <laughs> Number one daddo. Yeah, he did, all, he did all the DGGs. Like, not 100%. He didn't do 100% of the DGGs. But he helped work on them, because he's a wild dude. I'm gonna go get some more. 
Send you to fucking hell. Now she's like, heaven's waiting for you. Busting through. I solid laser. Whiffed it, buddy. You whiffed it. Classic Zenga. And the, the latest uh, Build Fighters battlelogue is hella Abari. Fucking holy moly. The Abari never stops. Time for my combo move. Go, a boosted rifle. What the heck is with this surface robot? It's so strong! It's not the R1, you're right, it's not the R1, it's the ART one! The advanced real trooper! How you doing, Lama? Sean, learning whatever move it is you just learned. Perfect. Damn, hell yeah, all of those things sound real good. Make that sound like a good place to be. Yeah, let's see. Fucking Jassy's robot sucks in the sky. I hate it. Yeah, Cross the smasher. Beam railgun. Damn, that bit doesn't sound so good though.
目標補足攻撃開始エネミーゴーム go in in ゴーム魔装鬼神を相手にするより楽かエアーティーワンスーパーコンボ。Let me show ya. Blade. Nice dynamic kill, I already was saying. I'll let you to not miss this time, Zango. <laughs> like this guy crashes his plane? Everybody crashes planes into people in OG games. It's fucking incredible. Every plane dude has a move where they turn on a force field and fucking crash into you. It's so good. I solid laser. Yeah. The problem with the say is that he wants to fuck a robot. And not like... A sexy lady robot. Just... The actual robot. Yeah! It's the Grungus Type 3! So, like, like there's the Grungus... Uh, you'll see the Grungus Kai in this game, which is the upgraded Grungus, and then there's the Type 2, which isn't in this game, and the Type 3. And the Type 0, which is the prototype one that they then based it on. And then the Type 2 is in um, Moon Dwellers. There's two of them, even. Divine. Um. Come on, Shine. Get him with your sword. Your sword that's bad against people on the ground. Oh, jeez. What are you looking at? Benkei. 
Not yet, not yet. That's the only thing I can deal with that. I'll show you that I don't need Latuni. And there you may have heard the little lady yelling, Fairy Shine, Shine Spark. Because. She loves to get a robo, don't she? Obviously. Good. He's so good. Shine's incredible. Now, now, little princess, calm down. I'll fucking kick your ass when we're done here. I mean, surely someone will, will come and save us. <laughs> it is like fucking lady, chill out. <laughs> She tries to act super ladylike, but she's a rude, crude gal. Let me show you what Grand Rails we got then, buddy. Kalork Smash! Okay, do we have Yang versus the guy? Uh, so, you realize what will happen if you help lose Earl, right? The revival of Volkris? It doesn't matter. Even if you have to use an evil god, it's all to defeat Langran. But you'll bring ruin to Trudodonius at the same time! Mm. And you guys got pretty high attack power. Fucking jog. I hate this dude. He just looks like a weird shit Ryusei. Crossed with the... Uh, uh, the G guy. And then, is that make some sort of joke? Kids shouldn't be fighting out here. I won't forgive anyone who disrespects my Fairlian. Fairlian. <laughs> He's a princess, it's not really okay for her to act like that. Well, I disagree, I think. I think princesses can act however they like. Oh, she, she says shine spark, not even spark, it's spark. It's fucking lady. Shoot, 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 shoot. Aren't her parents also in it? I don't know if see what that has to do with it. Like, she's definitely the ruler of Rixen. Like, she's definitely in charge of her stupid bullshit country. 
I want Zenga to fight him because Zenga says shit to him. Wait till we get the combo attacks, because you could, some of you guys don't know what the combo move is. You haven't seen the good shit. And then, what a huge machine! Jeez, what are the surface people thinking? You shall soon learn about my Dizengar soul. Dizengar arrives. Dizengar Zumbo, the sword that cleaves evil. And Shippu Jinrai is... Uh, yeah, Hurricane Thunderclap. So, like, Raging Storm. Chest Storm! What the? This is... I'm... We got Hachimaki, nice work. Then he blows up. Dang it! We came this far just to be pushed back. I'm not gonna die here like a damn dog. Retreat! All enemy signatures have disappeared. So, Uzo is helping Shudodonius. His objective is the revival of Volkris, right? Why would he cooperate with Shudodonius? And then Yang. They share interests. If Langran continues to be in a state of confusion, Luzel can move unopposed. And then Katina. But, if Focus is revived, wouldn't that be the end for Shudodonius too? Exactly. In order to obtain their current objectives, they're probably just cooperating for now. Captain, a few elementals from Kirk's army are approaching. They're requesting contact. Understood. We'll move from here and meet up with him. Captain. Visual confirmation of the elementals. Engines full stop. Keep the TDs at altitude 50. This is Tesla drives. How they fly. And here's Ash. Seems you didn't need us to come to provide, uh, provide relief. Uh, you're... It's 
been a while, Mr. Yanglong. It's Ashford! It's Ash. Has it been two years? You've grown up. You entered the military, I see. Well, it's the times we live in. By the way, Dad's coming this way, too. General Kirkus is coming? Yep. We thought the battle would still be going on over here, so we set out a while ago. And then here's Dean. So, that kid's General Kirkus's son? Kid? I'm not that much younger than you. I'm 18. Wow, then you're older than me. Sorry, you don't look very dependable, huh? <coughs> What's wrong? Uh, how old are you? 17. Uh, my name's Ashford, but you can call me Zash. What's your name? Huh? Suddenly your voice sounds a lot softer. Well, whatever, I'm Loon Zoldark. Loon? That's, that's a nice name. Y you think so? That robot you pilot looks nice. P flattery won't get you anywhere. But it's true, it's cute. Like you. Cute? Really? Me? <laughs> <laughs> Zash literally just hearing that lady's voice, he's like, HOLD UP! SHE'S A 17 YEAR OLD GIRL! FUCK! <laughs> Zash is such a good dude. Zash is such a good dude. But here's Kirkus. Zash, that's the completely wrong way to pick up girls. If you're a man, be more confident. D uh, Dad, I mean, uh, General Kirkus! Good work, Yang Long. I take that shooter Donius Brigade from earlier was after me. That's right. If you ask your questions, we need to talk. I've aligned myself with Prince Fail on the condition that Prince Tellius be put on the throne. Uh huh? But that's. Reckless? I know. Well, not throw away my ambitions. By my hand, Langran and the whole of Lagius will be unified. Lagius is unity? General, you're overlooking the feelings of the people. It's not like Prince Fail doesn't have faults, but if you neglect the order of succession... At this point, it doesn't matter what the people want. All that matters is doing whatever it takes to restore Langran as fast as possible. And then, when you've assumed control, you use the power of the restored Langran to unify Lagius? Exactly. This is the best way of keeping peace for a long time. Yang Long, I'll allow you to help me with this. Everything I've done has been for peace and the future of Lagius. Wait a minute. What is it? In short, you're saying you'll conquer the world? That's not right. I'm talking about lasting peace. Now, don't hide behind pretty words. No matter what you say, I know what you really mean. Your eyes. They're the same as my father's. You. Yeah. My old man said the same thing, but failed in the end. Though he amassed power, in the end he was defeated by an even more powerful force. When you gain great power, when you gain great power, it seems like you can uh, it seems like you can rely on it. But instead of relying on sheer force, there are better ways to do things. If you carelessly grab for power, you lose sight of that. You're just drunk on your own power. Sharper than I expected, Loon. I'm not about to be joining to Kirkus's circus. Something like that. I retract my statement. <laughs> I understand what you're saying, but I have no intentions of changing my plans. I've thought about this for a long time. Even if I'm seen as a traitor now, my actions will be judged as just by history. If you succeed, that is. History has a lot more failures than heroes. General, earlier I told you that I have duties and responsibilities as a pilot of an elemental lord. I cannot overlook your actions. You're saying you'll fight me? Yes. Understood. Usually I'd have no choice to kill you here, but... I'm not yet that cold-hearted to do that to my comrades. We're mounting a large-scale offensive on the Shudodonius army, alongside Fail's army. After that, we'll settle this. I will also participate in an attack against Shudodonius, but I have one thing I'd like to ask of you. And that is... No matter the outcome, you should send the Steel Dragons back to the surface. They're victims in all of this. No need to worry. The return spell is being prepared at the Seb Shrine in Valentine County. The surface dwellers can use it whenever they like. It's good to hear. Well then, General. Farewell. Be in good health. Strange thing to say to your enemies, I suppose. Anyway, I pray for our success. And then, Colonel Lafina, please head for Seb Shrine. You sure? Yes. After it becomes known that the preparations to send people back to the surface near completion will probably get very crowded at Seb. Understood. Off we go. Father, I also feel that you're wrong. Why do you think Prince Fail is useless? 
Zash, I'm assigning you to support Judy away from the front lines. If anything were to happen to me, I entrust your mother and Lam uh, Lemia to you. Father! Tarzan! I don't care if I'm not supposed to mix public and private affairs. My family is dear to me, but I have a responsibility greater than just my own life. Zash, you have to protect your mother in my stead. That's an order. Why didn't you tell me? I could have... Telling my plan to a common soldier like you is not necessary. I hate it. Dad, I'm no longer a kid. Which is something a kid would say. Place Lieutenant Zash under arrest. Detain him. D father And then internally, Zash, I won't ask you to forgive me, but I can't allow you to die before I do.